The CEO of MGM Resorts International is stepping down. Jim Marin's announcement comes as the company's fourth quarter earnings are released for last year. MGM executives also spoke about the deadly coronavirus at its resorts around the world. Sasha Loftus with more details. There is a lot to unpack here regarding this. CEO Jim Murren said he is stepping down just a few hours ago, but he will remain on board until his successor is found. Now, this comes also as Murren discussed the company's fourth quarter 2019 earnings. He calls the results solid but below expectations and says MGM finished the year with an all-time record for convention business. Marin touched on their recent devotion to sports and entertainment initiatives. He believes that these moves he's made as CEO will help the company thrive in the future. And so we're devoting a tremendous amount of effort and time to our sports and entertainment initiatives. It's certainly dragging down our P&L right now. But we are planting seeds which we believe will yield tremendous growth in the future. Murren also discussed the threat of the coronavirus and the subsequent closure of China properties. He says it's having an immediate impact, but he doesn't believe that will last into the long term as they have continued to pay workers there. Now, the good news here, Murren says he does expect a lot of growth for the first quarter of 2020. He says this will be due to the Raiders coming here to Las Vegas, to the convention center expansion, and to the MSG sphere. Now, no word on exactly why Marin is stepping down, but we do know he has been CEO of MGM since 2008. Reporting near the strip, Sasha Loftus, 8 News Now.